In this video, I'm unboxing this Synology Rackstation RS1221 Plus. You're watching Make Home Tech. Welcome to the channel, Home Tech Makers. I'm Joe and I love building technology for my home. Today I am very excited because this has arrived, the Synology Rackstation RS1221 Plus. This bad boy is gonna be my main storage array for my house and the Make Home Tech channel. I've been using Synology products for over 10 years now and they're very easy to use and very reliable. I strongly recommend them. Uh, we're going to open up this, actually unbox it first, and then take a peek inside. We're going to upgrade the network interface to an SPF Plus 10 gigabit network card. Oh, it's going to be fun. Let's get into it. Ah, yes, indeed. This is my new network attached storage from Synology. I'm going to open this up and stick a 10 gigabit card in it so that I can have really fast access to all of my files on this thing. So let's, uh, let's get started. Here it comes. Ta-da! Very nice. All right. Well, it looks like we've got, yeah, so it's uh, got replaceable RAM here. This looks like the main processor here and the main board. Uh, we've got a place to stick a expansion card. A couple of fans over here. Looks like 90 millimeters and a whole bunch of dry bays. Looks like some of this stuff can get pulled out. There's something underneath here. I think that's, yeah, that's the power supply. And then it looks like it's got another daughter board under here. And now it's time to put in the network card. So let's do it.
we go. I'm ready for 10 gigabit networking. Love it. So all I got to do is slap this thing full of hard drives and uh, away we go. All right, uh, one more quick thing, because uh, this is something that of interest to me, maybe some interest to you. Uh, one of the things I like to do with these machines is have extra trays so that I can swap out uh, hard drives quickly, right? So using the 321 methodology for backup, uh, three different copies of their data. So I usually have two of these things set up as a RAID, and then I've got a third drive, the same kind of drive, that I'll swap out on a monthly basis. Um, so in order to do that though, I need to know what kind of tray these things are. So I found this a little hard to find on Synology's website. Uh, these trays are R8 uh, trays. Uh, just so you remember that, it's an R8 tray. Uh, yeah, that doesn't come inside there. I made that, uh, maybe you can tell. It's my beautiful handwriting. Anyway, uh, R8 trays if you want to order extra spares uh, for swapping out drives quickly. All right, I hope you found that product exploration fun and informative. So, have you figured out why I'm attaching a massive network connection to this box? If you think you know, drop a comment below. Uh, also, if you like this video, hit that button and subscribe. And remember, keep learning, keep building, and make something great. I'll see you in the next one.